are all welcome in this video. In the previous video, we have seen an interesting example based on volume of a right circular cone. Today, in this video, we will see some interesting examples based on volume of right circular cone. Thomas, why have you dug up this huge conical pit? I made this to feed the birds. Oh, wow! But how much water can you fill in it? Let's try to find out. We can find the answer through mathematics. It's math time! Look, this pit is conical in shape. The amount of water it can fill is equal to its capacity and its capacity will be equal to the internal volume of the pit. Therefore, we only have to find the internal volume of the pit. I can quickly find the answer. The upper diameter of the conical pit is 12 centimeters. That means its radius is 12 divided by 2, which is 6 centimeters. The depth of the pit is 20 centimeters, which is also equal to the height of this conical pit. And as you know, because the height of this pit is perpendicular to its base, we can say that this pit is a right circular cone. Now, all we need to do is replace the values of the radius of the right circular cone R, which is 6 cm and its height H, which is 20 cm in the formula for the volume of a right circular cone. Look Manas, the internal volume of the pit is 754.28 cubic centimeters and we know that 1 centimeter cube is equal to 1 milliliter. Therefore, we can say that the capacity of the pit is 754.28 milliliters. That is a lot of water. Thomas, let us quickly return to our world. By now, many birds must have gathered to drink water from your pit. Both the friends were very happy to see many colorful birds drinking water from Thomas's pit. Friends, in this video, we saw an interesting example based on volume of a right circular cone. So hopefully you will now have a good understanding of the volume of a right circular cone.